Hi, so I am Connor Beekler, uh, and for my Talking Heads video, I will talk about the recent uh, 2016 NFL draft and who the Packers selected and kind of my take on each pick. So in round one, the Packers, with the 27th pick out of 32, they chose Kenny Clark, which is a who is a defensive tackle out of UCLA. Um, I was kind of surprised by this pick, honestly. I think a lot of people were. Uh, there was two very good Alabama defensive tackles that were still available, and there was no doubt that the Packers needed a defensive, a new defensive tackle with B.J. Raji uh, leaving or retiring. Um, although he's super young, not even 21 yet, it's still uh, it's still weird to see them not choose a B Alabama player. So we'll see how that pick uh, uh, pans out, I guess. Uh, in the second round, they chose a offensive tackle from Indiana. His name was Jason Spriggs. Uh, I think this is a pretty good pick because uh, not many people know him, but he's going to give us depth in the tackle positions as our line seems to get hurt quite a bit, so that'll be nice. Uh, and then round three, we chose an outside linebacker from Utah State named Kyler Fackrell. Uh, this was a pretty good pick in my opinion because we do need help at the inside or at the linebacker positions. Uh, and then the next pick also was uh, his name was Blake Martinez from Stanford. He was an inside linebacker. So uh, just really addressing the thin linebacker core that we actually have and hopefully letting Clay Matthews get back outside to rush the passer. Uh, and then in round four, we selected a defensive end and Dean Lowry from Northwestern. This uh, just helps our D-line again as it's not very deep and they get injured a lot. And then in round five, we picked a wide receiver from California. Uh, this is obviously going to help us in the depth of our wide receiver position as well uh, with Jordy going down last year and hopefully he's back up to standards this year and can perform, but that'll just help us in our depth in there. And then the sixth round, our last pick, we chose another offensive tackle in Kyle Murphy from Stanford. So all in all, it looks like Chad Thompson just went for depth in the in our thin positions, and in my opinion, was a pretty decent draft. Uh, for that reason, uh, really got a lot of depth in those positions, and it'll help the Packers out this year to go the long haul in the season. Thank you for listening, and have a good day.